Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. New York State Audit here. And we're at the Cahoe City Hall, located in Cahoe's, New York. We're here to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to record in public and publicly accessible areas. So I'm gonna give you some shots of the surrounding area before we go inside. And when we do get inside, I'm gonna fill out a FOIA request as I usually do and possibly even check out their uh, annual budget. So it looks like we got the signal. And it's a partly cloudy day. So I'm hoping that the people on the inside are going to shine, make up for the weather. All right, so I don't see any signs or anything that say uh, no trespassing. So we're gonna walk through. Let's make our way inside. So it appears that this is uh, the police entrance. So City Hall also has a police station with it or next to it. Oh, okay. Well, let's take a quick look real quick so we can at least see how the entrance looks maybe I'll come in after but I 
actually uh, took the Empire State Trail from Albany, New York to Cohoes, New York. I'm not sure exactly how long or far that is, but whew, I'm feeling it a little bit. I'm not going to front, but I still feel good, but it was definitely a long ride. Well, you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. At least until I get the car on the road. But for now, we gotta take care of business. So we're making our way inside. Let's see what kind of signs they have up. Looks like they got a mag. Hello. Hello. Can I help you? Yeah. Uh, you want to go in? Where are you looking to go? City clerks, a couple of other places. Okay. Book bag? Do you have a vaccination card? Or? I'm not going to answer that. You don't have to. I know. <laughs> oh. I don't have to. That's everything out of your pockets. So yep. That's going to set it off. All right. So where would you like me to put it? Um, I can hold it and give it back to you. Set, set it right here. Set it right here. So, uh, New York State Court Officer Bush and Palmer are the ones that greeted me. So we'll be heading in the city clerk's office in a moment. Uh, I can only assume that that's a... Uh... Oh no, this is city court right here, okay. So yeah, let's go in here real quick. Check it out. Hi. Hi. Excuse me, I just need to get in. No. Why not? Because we're working here and there's a customer here. So you're keeping a customer, another customer, you, yeah, from coming in. Put your phone in. down and then we'll, we'll go about our business. Oh, I'm, who am I speaking to? Annie Charg. Me. Annie Charg? I don't want to be filmed. Are you the uh, city do. clerk? No, um, you're not. No, I'm not. Okay, who this is? Do you want to talk to the city clerk? Uh, is this the city clerk office? 
Yeah. Is it, yeah. Assess. Awesome. Yeah. So I would like to go in there without you uh, keeping me from going in there. Put your phone down. No, actually, I'm not going to do that. That's okay. I'm going to respectfully decline that. Hey, Mark. Yes. So I'm going to. No, you're not coming through and filming us. You're going to have to go. No authority. City Hall matter. So if you want, I can get the police department, but I have no I don't authority. want to do that, and I just want her to be able to help you. Could you put that down? No, I'm, I'm respectfully declining that, ma'am. I have a right to document my see, my business you're overstepping in, in a, in a your public. With me. No, not really. This I is don't a... want to do it. You want to, so you're saying. <clears throat> can I explain? Your, your will is more important than mine. I didn't say my will. I didn't say my will. Please do not put words in my mouth. I said no. You have the same rights as as citizens. We all have rights to. Uh, uh, film in public areas. Can you not? Can you please not? I'm trying to. I'm asking you. I'm trying to, to conduct stop. business, miss. And you're keeping me. You know what? She's you're, on lunch from you, 12 to 1. Did you know that you're committing you a violation? Go about your business. She's not here. She's on lunch. So. Hey, Jimmy, this gentleman would like to conduct business. Wow. Very, very unprofessional. Very. You should respect her wishes. What are you filming no. for? Exactly. I'm sorry? Why are you filming? I'm just gathering content for a story. Mask who I'm talking to? Wow. All right, let's go over here. Okay. Um, I don't really see the, the big deal. I, this is a public space. And so even though you know this, you're going to give me a hard time and I'm correct. Wow. You know, I have a right. We all have a right as, you know, the people. I have a right not to be filmed. Okay, but you're at work as, as a public okay, servant. No, I don't like to be filmed at work. As a public I'm servant. Like well, I guess you should work okay, in the private sector. You sir, you can, f if you would like to call the police to get me out, I wouldn't recommend that, but you do what you have to do, sir. Okay, because I'm not going to leave. I have a right to be here, okay? First Amendment right, to be exact, sir. Freedom of the press? I'm not sure if you remember that. So, uh, I would like to uh, be provided with services, please. What do you need? I would like first to know who I'm talking to before I ask what I need. I am not gonna turn off my camera, sir. So you're going to decline me services? You know, that's a violation of so New York. Get the, here, get the hell out of here. Is that how you talk to the citizens? Wow. By refusing services, sir, you're violating New York penal law, section 240.65, okay, which is unlawful prevention of public or access to public records. Excuse me. So right now you're preventing me from, from those records. Can you help me, please? There's a, a, a customer here. You guys are violating my rights. You guys are also committing a, a federal crime, okay? This, what I'm trying to do is federally protect it, and you're keeping me from doing that. It's part of the United States Code, Title 18, Section 245 federally protected activity, so I would like to please get a FOIA request. All righty. Hi, how's it going? Good, how are you? I guess I could be better if I was treated with respect, but, you know, I guess that isn't the case, so that's pretty much how I am. What are you looking for? Are you, do you work for the city clerks or like, what, what's your name and title, sir? I work upstairs in the code office. What can uh, I oh, your code enforcement? Yeah. Awesome. Nice to meet you. Uh, can you, can I get your name if you don't mind? Huh? May I have your name, please? My name's Ed. Ed? Nice to meet you, yeah. Ed. Uh, I actually don't need any help from code enforcement. Um, I just needed help from the city clerks, but they're refusing to provide me services. They're violating my rights, you know? So how do you feel about that? They must have a reason why they're not talking to you. Something must be going on. Well, from the communication that we're having right now, do you think there's any reason? There should be any reason? I don't know. I don't know. How come you're, right. how come you're I'm actually going to come out here and check out the rest of the building. <laughs> <clears throat> hey, how's it going? How's it going? First Amendment, auditor. 
I'm just taking pictures and videos, yeah, man. Yeah. Just, you know the game. Yeah, I, I don't know what game you're referring to. Can I get your, your name and badge number, please? Yes, you can. It's Detective Matt Orton, 1521. Matt Orton? Orton? I'm sorry. O-R-T-O-N. Orton. Yes. Okay, and badge number was? 1521. 1521. And you, sir? I'm Officer Sorrell. Badge number 1550. Okay, Sorrell, and you? Officer Hagre, badge number 117. Hagre? 117? Okay. So you can tell him I don't want to have the video. Oh, that's all. Because that's what they were saying, and then. Not much. I'll be right back. So, uh. The only thing is, just don't interfere with court operations. I don't have any intentions for all that. Oh, I need a. Please don't go away that quick. I'm going to need the incident number. And it's a number yeah. you can always go to no, no. fill out what's called for. Oh, uh, is it, it's next door? You have to yes. fill out a forward request. Yeah. For the incident number? You guys were yes. called here. Okay. So, yeah. no, so you guys are supposed to generate. So the way you can get there is get through those doors there. You can walk Yeah, around it's right next door. Right I just walked by. Yep. Perfect. Yeah, but that's that. Right front of so that's, that's how Cahols works? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so, so if there's a, a situation or a crime of some sort, the, the victim would have to go to the police station to get the Final incident report? Yes. That doesn't even make any sense. but. Okay, but you were called here for me. Okay. All right, so I'm just... Okay, so... It's right next door. And what information would I use to do that? What information? What you want. Get the description, date, the time. Okay. And um, Kathy's the police aide. She'll take you through everything. All right. Everything is emailed. We'll email it to you. Okay, perfect. All right. All right. Oh, matter of fact, before you go, you should go in here and de-escalate this situation. Please don't don't sigh like that. I'm not doing anything wrong. Because you're okay. just de-escalate. I, I, well, you don't know. Let me explain. Because you're already giving me a little bit of attitude. I don't oh, appreciate it. I'm just saying. Just can we have a conversation, please? So I'm not going to talk to you at the moment. So can you please uh, tell them to provide me with services that I have a right? Okay. What were you asking for? I'm asking for the annual budget. I would like to look at the annual budget as well as a FOIA request form. Everything's online. I I'm here. Give me a piece of paper then. Okay. I have a right to file it here. Okay? Yep. And I, I would also, I'm not going to, see, that's the issue. This is a public building. Yes. I have a right to film, so explain that to him. He does, he's refusing services because I'm filming. Okay. Is that how you speak to, to the citizens? I don't work in this department. Oh, well, it doesn't matter what department you work. Is that how you would speak to the citizens? I'm you that way. Nah, I'm just, no. I'm just asking you, all right? And your opinion is well, that. In my opinion, I'm not allowed to have an opinion because I'm working. I don't okay, know what his all right. Are. Okay, um, all right. Mean, all right. There's, you keep calling it a game, it's no I game to me. I understand what All right, you're doing. the Constitution is not a game to me. Yeah, I know okay, it might be a game to you guys, no, you know, and I don't know specifically, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? But you, honestly, she's been the one. She looks serious, but she's been on some chill stuff. Mm -hmm. You, I don't know, man. I'm getting like, you gave me like, when you identified yourself, you gave me some issues with your face. Like, look, I didn't call you. I didn't it's call like you guys. I didn't say he wasn't. I'm just saying. You guys came here and you guys are looking at me a no. certain, in a negative light and I didn't even do anything wrong. So you can get that Our information call. online, he said, right? So I'm not, I'm not on, getting it online. He He's online. gonna give me a piece of, I know, the, I know the drill, the game, like he says, okay? So it's all available online. I am, you can talk to the camera all you want. I'm just looking at I it. am going to, camera, awesome. So please stop being rude and let me speak. I'm not being rude, man. Just Dude, you're talking right over me though. I'm trying to explain something to you. Because you're telling me where to go, and I'm telling you I'm not going to where. See what I mean? Can I speak to you? Because you seem like you might be willing to speak to me respectfully. You know, you're forgetting your mission statement right now. To be professional. You know what I'm saying? Sure, Don't I laugh in my face. That's, that's, no, you're not. You're laughing in my face. Is that professional? So what you got going on? What else is going on? I would like a piece of paper so I can file the FOIA request on paper. Because I can do that. I don't have to do an email. Dude, man, just give me a piece of paper. If you go, yes. Yes. Uh, you said you want the FOIA request, right? Yep. So I want a piece of paper so I can write it down. Okay. So what they just told you? No, it's not gonna happen. Sorry. You have to go. It's only right around. Sorry. Just I I've done this before. When you go to a city hall, village hall, you know, town hall. Listen, let me explain. Okay. If you don't have a FOIA request paper, physical paper form, I can write it down on a piece of paper requesting what I need. Okay, yeah, like so you're gonna learn today. Like you're gonna learn today from here. From here. Okay. From here. I want FOIA requests from here, not the police station. So you need okay? one from this department. So your job is done. What is All right. I don't need you to. I, he he's already helping me. Okay. I don't like your condescending tone. To be honest, you're smiling in my face like it's a game. Okay. It's not. You need to take notes from her. You really do. Maybe you guys should swap positions. Okay. To be honest. Okay. Well, that's your opinion, man. 
Um, and I'm entitled to it. Absolutely. Right. Everyone's entitled to their opinion. Yep. Not you, though, because you're working. <laughs> See what I mean? So just remember that. You're entitled off duty. You're entitled to your opinion. But when you're on the clock, player, you're not. Well, I'm just trying to have a conversation. Okay. With well, the, you it. were. All right. Now it's, it's becoming a conversation because I had to regulate and put you in your place. Okay. Yeah, because you're all like, ha, ha, ha. It's not a game. I didn't call the police. Do you think I want to go to a public building where I have a right to film and have cops uh, come to me? All right, approaching me, all right, yeah. sitting here giving me negative attitude for what? Because I'm engaged in a constitutionally protected activity? Sure Come on, right. man. I'm, I don't got time for that. Any other public buildings or anything like that? If you want to have conversations, uh, she works here? Excuse me, miss. Are you the city clerk by any chance? No, she doesn't work in this department. Oh, okay. Or, um, Jim? You don't? Okay. Do you have a second to do a oh, receipt for me, please? So there we go. Awesome. That's where you get the budget and everything. Okay, Boy, yeah, I need a whole piece of paper, please. An oh, uh, actual piece of paper, I would like to okay. thank you. Yes, that's what I asked for. You went over there and you had your own agenda, you know, know. so. So let's just get the piece of paper. You guys could be on your way because I didn't call you. They're overreacting. I, I hope you, I'm glad you know they're overreacting. I'm glad. We're used to it. Okay. Well, see, this is your chance to shine, though. This is your chance. You I'm just right saying. All right. Awesome. Well, explain that to everybody because they closed the door on me, sir. You know what that, how that felt no. when I'm trying to walk in and somebody closes the door in your face? All right. In a public, this is public area. Okay. And if, but they've also gone through some things. With like what? Not so nice people coming in here upset about things and getting a little. Okay. And I'm pretty sure usually they're not filming. Okay. So what's the big deal with me? I came in here having a cordial conversation, calm conversation with them. Okay, and, my, and the door gets closed in my face? Why are you writing on that? I don't need that piece of paper. I don't need, need you writing. For, for me to write. So you don't even listen to me. Give me another piece of paper, a blank one, and do not write on it. God, man. You guys don't even listen to me. I need the paper. They don't have to listen to you. This is my department. Are we done? We done? All right. Awesome. Have a good day. You know how to get your four requests from us. Yes, I do. Thank you very much. Yep, good luck to you, too. I would like this, the uh, business card to the city clerks, please. And I'm, I'm talking to, to anybody who wants to uh, provide me services here, finally, now that they know that I have a right to do this. And of course, nobody's gonna help me. Are you the city clerk? No. Oh, okay. I can't. Sorry. I don't know what you need, but I can't help you. If, if you... it's city clerk services, then no. Okay, yeah, then sorry. Sorry. No, nah, it's all good. Thank you, though, for taking the time out to talk with me, at least. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate that. I appreciate the professionalism and the courtesy. Um, awesome. Are you good, though? You have what you need? Uh, I would actually like... Right now, I'm filing a FOIA request. I'm going to do a uh, paper form sure. uh, because you guys don't have the, the physical copies or mm -hmm. forms for me to do so. Um, I'm sorry, may I ask who I'm speaking to? Sure. My name is Amanda. Nice to meet you, Amanda. You too. Um, What's your name? Well, I don't really give my name okay. out uh, when I'm uh, conducting my business, to be honest. Oh, uh, sure. But you can, you, can, you can refer to me as good citizen for the time being. Hello, good citizen. <laughs> yeah. So... Uh, Okay, so the FOIL request, so you're waiting for the city clerk. Yeah, uh, yes, I'm waiting okay. for the city clerk. Okay. Uh, you don't work for the city clerk, you said, so there's you really yeah. can't do nothing for Sorry. me here. Um, it's Amanda, you're so awesome, Sorry. too. No, it's okay, you're still awesome, don't yeah. worry about it. All right, thank you. Thank you, All you right, too. You. It's okay. They can help me, but they're choosing not to. They, they, wanna, they would rather violate my rights than to have a customer leave happy. And today's day, I'm sorry, Miss Amanda, is it the 23rd or 24th? That's like, hold on, let me think. Let me Good think. question, right? Yeah. It's the 4th because, the 24th. Yes, because we were supposed to film yesterday. So I'm surprised he even told me. Thank you, sir. That, see, I would thank you properly, but I don't know your name. Would you like to identify yourself now? Thank you, good citizen. Have a great day. Thank you, Miss Amanda. You too.
Okay, I'm all set. So I'm going to need your assistance, sir. I'm going to need this FOIA request uh, uh, stamped and copied for me, please. Come on, let's act like an adult and let's, you know, thank you. Lori's card. So that's Lori's card. Okay. So this is who I can uh, file formal complaints and redress my grievances. She's the clerk. You asked right. for the clerk. Card. Okay. So yeah, this, yeah, yep, this is the card. So, uh, and this is the FOIA. I can just attach this if you want. Hold on a second. This is the FOIA request form? Yeah. Wow. Are you kidding me? You guys just sat there and made a big deal about not having the FOIA request. Would you like it? No, I'm, I'm going to accept. Do you think this is acceptable, the treatment that you guys are providing me? Be the FOIA request. Okay. Did you, see how, I, did you see how I had to? No, I'm going to keep this, and, but you're going to, because I'm not, no, no. Do you want to file it? No, I, yeah, I want you to file this one because I'm not going to rewrite it. This is still acceptable. I would like that st stamped and copied. I want a, a photocopy of it stamped, please. Okay. And I don't appreciate that you gave me all this hassle telling me to file a FOIA request online when I have a right to do it in person. But yet you have the actual form, physical copy. Okay. And you called the cops and made a scene for what? I'm just curious. You definitely should be ashamed of yourself. You really should. Especially that gentleman in the back right there, okay? For telling me to get the hell out of here. But naturally I'm talking on deaf ears. Never did I try to go into a public office, a public building, and have the door slammed on me, closed on me by anyone. And you said your name was what? Can I get your name again? I can't remember it. Annie. Annie, and what was your last name? Just Annie. Oh, well, it's on the door, you said. Chard, right? Yeah. Yeah, you see? Annie Chard. Awesome. And what is your position here exactly? Your title. Please don't be rude to me. I'm doing my job. Okay, yeah, it's called multitasking though. I, I just need your title. And I say that respectfully, you know, because you, had an, you are in a position where you should be able to multitask. Anything else after this? Uh, just your title. Yeah, your position here. Deputy treasurer. Deputy treasurer. And be able to see all the information. Yes, the FOIA of course. Okay. Yes, of course. Yeah, that's the whole point of the FOIA request. Anything else? Um, well, I could definitely stick around and give you some pointers on how to treat the citizens, but that's pretty much it. Yeah. Okay, you're okay. Yeah. Hey, thank you. You take care, and and hopefully you have a great day. Awesome. You too. So, uh, we have three business cards here. One name is Thomas E. Uh, Jacquees. I'm not sure if I pronounced that right. Maybe that's this gentleman here. I'm not sure. Is that you, Mr. Jacquees? Uh, either way, I did a FOIA request, so I'll get that information. But, uh, oh, I would appreciate if you give it to me now so I can file uh, a formal, uh, excuse me, a formal complaint. Because I do have a right to redress my grievances. And I don't appreciate being told to get the hell out. Wow, okay. Very, very professional. Oh, do you know when the, the 
City clerk is coming back. You know when she'll be back? About two o'clock. Two o'clock? Awesome. So you're willing to talk to me about things, but you're not willing to identify yourself, even though, to the best of my knowledge, it's your policy to do so? Who are you? A citizen that has a right to come in a public building. What's your address? You want my address, really? You're being ignorant like that? I'm not asking you for private information. Well, you're being ignorant. You are. Yes. Huh? I, I'm not going to leave. Sorry. I actually want your name so I can file a complaint. Right now, you're, you're violating my First Amendment right, my right to redress my grievances to our government, and you're keeping that. You have a right. What right is that? that I'm, what am I taking from you? What rights? Can you, you want to clarify that? All right, because you sound silly. I haven't taken anything from you. If anything, you're giving me plenty. And that's why I labeled it ignorance. But you don't want to identify yourself, that's okay. I'll get that information. Thank you. All right, so we're going to head upstairs. I don't really appreciate I'm going to get that guy's name because I don't appreciate being spoken to like that. Nice, nice little setup. I know it's a little dark in here, so hopefully uh, it looks decent. Yeah, I, I, I'm not going to front. I, I'm, I'm definitely filing complaints against that office. That woman closed the door on me. Her, the door hit my leg. It was pinned against my body. Like crazy. I'm not even going to bother calling police or anything like that to try to file any kind of harassment charges or nothing. Because in my opinion, they're not going to do anything. And like I said, that's just my opinion. This is a corporation council. Hi. Hi. Can I help you with something? Yeah, I was just actually walking around and gathering uh, content for my video. Video for what? Oh, just. Just for uh, well, I, I honestly I would love to tell you, but I don't want to compromise my story. So, okay. but I'm just walking around in, in publicly accessible areas. Okay. I'd really rather not videos. Well, I'm I'm not gonna be long. I'm just gonna you know. We all have. Personally, I don't want to be on anybody's video or anything like that. Oh, okay. So. Um, can I can I ask who I'm speaking to just so I know who I'm conversing with? Sharon. Nice to meet you, Miss Sharon. Um, what, what, I, I didn't really catch what was, uh, what you guys did here in particular. part of the planning office. Okay. All right. Okay. Awesome. Well, thank you for your time. Okay. Have a great day. Just looking around. How's right, speaking to? I'm not looking to be videotaped right now, so no. Oh, so why, why would you speak to me then and ask me if I need help if you see me filming? <laughs> and so you, I see you filming a door. I didn't give you permission to film me, so 
Okay. Well, actually, I don't need your permission. We're in, we're in a public building. You didn't know that? Sorry, could I help you? <laughs> yeah, um, since we're conversing, can I get your name and your title here? I'm Joe Stephen Gray, city planner. Oh, you're the city you? planner. Nice to meet you. Oh, no, not at all. Just taking okay, pictures of video. Thank you. All right, I sure will. Thank you. And oh, just as some advice, man, if you don't want to be on, on camera, don't come up to the cameraman. So there's his name, city planner's name. This is the Department of uh, Public Works Water Meter Bureau. So, uh, this is a public office, but he told him to close the door and he clearly locked it. So, you know, they're creating their own privacy. Hey, how's it going? You're Gary? I'm not Gary. I'm his assistant. You guys look like you need some, some reorganizing, that's, man. That's the engineering department, man. Oh, man. This looks crazy. This is, this is all the, the documents and paperwork for all the buildings in the city. Well, so, hey, if, if the system works for you guys, yeah, you know, and if like it's... I, a, I'm, this is uh, my first week here, and... Uh, like I said, the engineer is not here, but he seems to know exactly where everything is. And that's Gary, right? Gary Nathan? Yep. Okay. All right. Uh, can I get your name? My name's Shane. Sh Shane? Shane Lewis. Shane Lewis. Yep. Okay. One of, well, you're going to be one of the stars here. I can tell already. I can tell um, just by having the conversation with you. And, you know, I just came from the city clerk's office, and they just closed the door on my face and everything, all because I'm filming, which I mean, I, we have a right to do this. I'm not sure if you're aware. You know? I, 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 <laughs> I know it's not illegal to film anything. I mean, I, I've got nothing to hide back here. Well, it's not about, about hiding, having something to hide. You know, it's just about what we have a right to do, you know, yeah. and, we, and we have a right to do that. You know, you see how we're, we're conversing. Are, 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 you, are you doing, are, are you just exercising your right? Just, I'm just taking pictures and video. Hey, guy. Yeah. Can I talk to you for a minute? Can you do me a favor, please? Yeah. Please step out here, okay? Don't, don't videotape in here, please. I'm sorry, why is that? This is the planning engineer's office, and there's confidential stop in here right please okay all right i'm gonna okay. come out but can you not just okay. keep your hands to yourself right, because this is, you know there's plans in here all right i just want like I, i'm gonna i'm coming out sure. thanks uh I, but i want to i'm sorry who are you that's right who are you excuse me sir can i can you identify yourself please i see a badge there yeah, say there's certain, certain rooms that No, there's not. Afford. Look, and it doesn't say restricted. It doesn't say employees but, but only. There is plans on there. So then put you, learn to organize your stuff then. How are you going to take it out on me? I'm not taking it out. You I, just, asked, I asked you very politely, please. Okay. Thank you. You did, while okay. touching me. You, you politely and I you just, touched me. I just said please. Right, but not, all right, but not everybody wants to be touched. Okay, and on top of that, who's this guy? Huh? Who's this guy that came out? He's another code officer. Okay, can I get his... his uh, he, he don't want to talk on film. He don't have to speak to you on film. Well, I'm a citizen that's asking him I mean, he to identify to himself. He doesn't want to speak. He okay. don't want to be videotaped. Okay. All right? Thank you. Wow. I definitely can feel the love here. Well, give a uh, shout out to Shane. So far, uh, oh, and Amanda. Shane and Amanda, the two two stars here. I'm glad they're actually here and that I've actually got to meet them. That area right there, that's the court area you're talking about? Awesome. So you guys got a, a sign right there that says employees only, but it's not chained up. What's that about? I'm just confused. I'm 
Because, like, what if I was walking, you know, like, there's, I there's honestly no, didn't see it. No offices down there or anything like that. I think there's another men's and ladies room. Okay. But, and storage stuff down there. All right. That's, uh, I thought that was just odd. Because I'm ready to go down, but I can't. All right. I'm almost finished, though. That's the bathroom. Well, let's get this picture at least. Alright, so I'm gonna go back into the city clerks. So I can see if I can actually get this guy's uh information from the city clerk. Yeah, can go in there. So property right now that has these two garbage cans with this number on them. Yeah. I'll call you in a minute, okay? And uh, I just want to know if I can move them from one property to another. Ah, uh, that would be upstairs. Um, talk to DPW. Half the stairs, left, last door on the right. Thank you. Yep. Is the uh, city clerk back? Nope, two o'clock. Two o'clock, huh? All right, I guess I'll hang around. Please wait outside. Wait outside? Yeah, no thank you. Why are you trying to kick me out? There's plenty of seats right here. Isn't these seats for the citizens? No, they're not. So who are they for? Employees? Come on now, you know how that sounds? Why would employees sit on this side of the counter? Wow. Definitely rude. I'm just trying to get your, your name and your title so I can be on my way. Do you work for the treasurer? Assessor? Oh, you're just an IT man? Oh. Is that why your communication skills are not up to par? Yeah, I'm not surprised. So twelve. So so you're uh, the city clerk's has been lunch on all this time because it's at what twelve twenty five, and I've been here for forty eight minutes, almost forty nine minutes. They've been in lunch on lunch the whole time. She had a doctor's appointment before lunch. Oh, okay. So why don't you be a, a class act for me and just identify yourself so I can be on my way? Bob Montgomery. I'm sorry, Montgomery. What, what was your first name? Robert. Well, I'm sorry, I can't hear that. Robert Montgomery. Robert Montgomery. Okay, awesome. See, thank you. I appreciate that. Now I'm going to be on my way. Okay, but just so you know, if you gave me a, a false name to keep me from redressing my grievances, that'll be wrong too. You'll be held accountable for that, just so you know. So have a great day, sir. All right, guys, thank you. Thank you for uh, your professionalism and courtesy. I appreciate that a lot, trust me. Yo, thank you, stay safe. Really? You yeah, had to press down on the lever. Okay, Woo, thank you. I, yeah, it does say pull, but it don't say pull the, uh, the push the button with it. Thanks, man. All right, so we're all finished. We'll walk across the street to the park from where we started the video. But uh, as you can tell, you saw for yourself, the woman tried to close the door on me. <laughs> the Montgomery, Mr. Montgomery, if that's even his, his real last name told me to get the hell out oh man these guys are just unprofessional all because I'm filming you know she was keeping me from going in they called the cops for no reason you know and then when the cops come instead of uh de-escalating the situation and, and and taking that moment that opportunity 
to to you know just ease their mind and explain that we have a right to do this you know i don't i don't really know what he said to be honest he he doesn't have he didn't have a body camera on uh and the officer that i was speaking to i can't remember his name you know he's over here smiling in my face you know it's to them it's a game you know like to me it's not a game when i'm being mistreated it's not a game for me you know but other than that i'm gonna wrap this video up it's it's been long enough i took a long ride over here on top of all that you know i was just gonna do one one video but i think i might do two or maybe even three that's how long the ride was that uh empire state trail that i took but it was definitely beautiful beautiful trail and i took some pictures along the way things that i saw but uh, other than that you know if you guys like the video smash that like button hit the share buttons that way we can expose the good the bad and the ugly thank you guys for watching the video i appreciate the love take care of one another and i'm gonna see you guys next time